Task 4.2 HD. Let's start with the breadboard. So you do this setup. Looks quite messy, but data pins. So two, four, six. Going in down here. Connecting the resistor to the positives and all the LEDs. Um, red's currently on because that's my last toggle button on my side. Um, but the negatives all going to ground. Going into ground. Pretty basic stuff there. To the code. Also pretty basic. Got my pins. Blue green. Two four six like six four. Um, initializing the function up here, so it works out of there. So set up. Just giving my pins output. Initializing function here on the uh, from my um, HTML page. That's the uh, function it'll be calling for this function hand to be handled. So that's called via a post request, which I'll show in a second. Nothing in the loop. Uh, so this gets called first. Checks the string color, uh, which gets passed into the post request. All colors off, so it just turns all the colors off first to make sure more than one isn't on at the same time. If red, turn red on. That's just to post to the event um, particle so I can see the change. But if green, turn green on. If blue, turn blue on. And every time, turn all the colors off at the start. So, well, HTML, let's see how it's work. Very, very, very basic here. Just got some HTML ball plate there. With three checkboxes, just red, green, blue, very basic. Uh, where have I got this? It's applied. Yeah, oh, here. So at the moment I have, I'm to put this somewhere I can see both. Red, red's on. Click green. Green zone. If I click blue, ready, blue zone. Back to red. Oh, I didn't show you my JavaScript. Um, so, yeah, the checkboxes, sorry. And JavaScript, so getting all the checkboxes in an array. Um, come back to this, but adding an event listen to each checkbox. Probably could have done that to the array of checkboxes, but on a click sends data. That click is an event which passes in this event here. Um, so I set color to the e target value, which will always be red, green, or blue. It's the access token that was generated. We'll probably have to delete that after this video. Um, to get it working, it had to be sent in the post request. So it's my array of checkboxes for each. And that's just to make sure only one was on at a time. So whatever one isn't clicked, they all turn off. And I used Axios to post this just because that's what I'm used to. So if you have particle, it's my particle device. That's the function exposed on the cloud. Um, I tried to send the access token in the body, but didn't work as well, so I found out this works better. Well, it works. Access token and access token and args is the color that's just passing every time. So, and then I just got a console logging because that's all I could be bothered doing. Mm, yeah, that's it.